Tonight, our ABC News investigation looking at the 100 U.S. counties with the highest rate of death and where so many families seem to know someone lost to this. Here's Steve Osinsami. Let them know that all they got to do is call on the name of Jesus. Reverend Willard Weston in Terrell County, Georgia, says that church services here have never been this empty. So now he live streams them online on some nights from his home. God wants you to be blessed. Families still worry that if they come to church, they could get sick and die. The coronavirus hit this rural community hard. 33 people were killed during the height of the pandemic. Does it surprise you to know that your county is on the list of one of the hardest hits places in America? No, I'm not surprised because it was happening so frequently. ABC News and our ABC owned stations across the country have taken a close look at the data and it shows the 100 counties in the U.S. with the highest rate of death. What many of them have in common, most are rural, poor and have limited access to quality health care. The hardest hit, Gove County, Kansas. And it's been hard because we have cared for them for so long. In South Georgia, there were so many graveside funerals, the ministers here had trouble clearing the red Georgia clay from their shoes. And then in October, the strain of this pandemic closed one of the few remaining hospitals. When this hospital closed, it was an incredible loss for people who live in this part of Georgia. It served patients across six counties and was a lifesaver during the height of the COVID crisis here. Now, those same people have to drive up to an hour away to get to the closest hospital, and some residents have to drive into Alabama to get to an emergency room. What happens if this county sees March again? Um, I think we may, may see a lot of fatalities. We were moved by the story of one woman who lost three relatives and told us that it feels like the rest of this country has forgotten about her part of America. Here at the Centers for Disease Control, they're out with a new report tonight that shows that at the height of this pandemic, the cities that were hit hardest with the highest rates were urban areas. But tonight, it's small towns and small cities. David? Yeah, we cannot forget about all of these communities where everyone seems to know someone that's been moved and touched by this and in some cases lost a loved one. And Steve, this is really important reporting. Thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.